welcome back to another video. As you guys know, I recently got the Glorious Model D, and I love this mouse, and I've used it for probably the past couple weeks, and it's great. It's so much better than my old one. I can kind of drag click on it, and all sorts of stuff. But, when I was um, looking on the interweb, I found something, and this thing's called Grip Tape, and I've seen a lot of YouTubers do stuff like this, so I decided, you know what, I'll buy some. So, I bought the Razer Mouse Grip Tape for the Viper Mini, and the Viper Mini is supposed to fit this Model D very, very well. So let's get that installed. Okay, so we now have the Grip Tape open, and we're just going to pull out, I think there's something in here we can pull out. Nope. Yep, okay, so, done that, let's check, is there anything else left in here? There is not. So this is all of our grip tape right there. So this is gonna go on right like that. That actually looks like it'll fit decently. We might need to make some modifications, but it doesn't look like we'll have to do too many. And for now, I'm just gonna put it on the right because I don't know about the left. I don't know if we even need it on the left, but it's there if we really need it. Okay, let's cut this off. And already just kind of sticking it on, you can see it fits looks like it fits pretty well on there so let's uh let's get this thing actually installed okay so as you can see we have a nice snug fit uh first impressions makes a nice sound so let's start playing with this okay so we are on hypixel now in minecraft and we're gonna play some games and uh just see how we like the grip tape here as you can see, today we have the hand cam, just to show you guys what is uh, going on with my hand and everything, because I think that's something pretty important when you're doing mouse stuff. But I'm not going to lie to you guys, I have actually been using this mouse, uh, mouse grip tape for probably the past day or so, but as you can see, it is incredible. Like. I can do, I can, my CPS is so much higher, if you look at my CPS, it is so high, versus before, I could, like, you know, especially drag clicking, I would struggle to get up this high, for sure. But now it's a lot easier. Yeah, as you can see, my CPS is a lot higher, I don't know how to, like, god bridge or anything yet, um, that is definitely something I plan on doing, because I would like to do that. But yeah, as you guys can see, I have... Uh, the tape on the hand cam, it looks really nice actually, the way that it was applied, um, just the way it turned out actually came out really nice. It fits on like perfectly, I was surprised how well it fit, because it fits like perfectly onto the, um, on the mouse, like it was almost like it was made for it, even though this is a Razer Death Adder, or not Death Adder, uh, Razer Viper grip tape versus, uh, my mouse is of course the Glorious Model D. So I was a little surprised about that just because it works so well, but yeah. But yeah, it definitely makes drag clicking a lot easier. Like like I said, I can do it just so much faster now. And I would definitely recommend it if you have something like the uh, Model, uh, Model O or Model D and you can't drag click because I know a lot of people can drag click without tape and I could to some extent, but it just wasn't as good. Like I couldn't get it I couldn't drag click this high CPS, I guess, with um, without any tape. Like, I know people can, I know it's possible, but I just wasn't one of those people. But yeah, like I was saying, I would definitely recommend it if you're having trouble drag clicking. It's like $10 and it works like really well. Like I said, I have the Razer Viper Mini and that or rather, I have the Razer Viper Mini Grip Tape. That's the kind that I'm using. And it fits perfectly. Like, I don't think you need another kind. Uh, I've heard of a company called Lizard Skin. I think they also have grip tape, and they do it a little differently. But honestly, I think this is fine just on its own. It's really, really nice. But yeah, now is also a great time to talk about my upload schedule. And about that, I'm going to try and upload at least... Uh, two times a week now I can't guarantee this every single day or every single week rather just because obviously holidays 
uh, you know, I'm going places, visiting, stuff like that. But yeah. And talking about my upload schedule, I'm trying to hit at least two uploads a week. Uh, it's a little tough sometimes just because I have school, obviously. Uh, and I have a lot of other stuff to do as well. And like I said, holidays, stuff like that. But I will be trying to get at least uh, two a week because I think that is reasonable. Wow, that was annoying. So yeah, I'm working on my upload schedule. Hopefully it'll be good. Um, during the summer, I'm definitely going to be uploading more. Probably like at least twice a week. Maybe even more. Maybe three times a week if, uh, like if I don't have a lot to do that week or whatever. But yeah, so far, uh, I think I'm doing pretty decent on uploads. But yeah, I'd say at least for the next month, expect uploads twice a week because that's just the time I have. Uh, like I said, during the summer, it'll be a lot easier. I'll upload a lot more, and hopefully, I'll start being, I'll start saving up for a computer, so I'll be able to like record in higher quality and just not be so laggy. Like that was awful. So yeah, I think this grip tape is really nice. I can dry click a lot more consistently with it. Uh, I still need to learn a little bit, and then eventually I'll be able to god bridge which would be nice. Again, mouse looks really clean with it. I mean, it looks super nice if you look at that. But yeah, I'm learning how to god bridge and also I'm gonna try and fix my upload schedule and upload twice a week on Wednesdays and Saturdays for at least the next month. So expect that and I'll see you guys in the next video. Sunshine, rainfall, I can see the snowfall I've been vibing to the same old songs all day